one of the other features of the new ECU manager software uh, is its uh, main setup structure. You can see it looks quite different to the Howwin structure there. So um, once you hit the main setup, you'll see there's four different tabs. Essentially, these are the main setup tabs that you had in Howwin also. They contain the same information. So engine type, whether it be piston or rotary, number of cylinders, load source, so on and so forth. I have the trigger setup again, very similar to Howwin software where you select the trigger type. You see there actually are a few more trigger types in the Platinum Sport series of ECUs than there were in previous versions of Howwin. Select whatever trigger type you have, trigger edge, so on and so forth, all very similar to what we have in the Howwin software. You notice on the right hand side here, if you select a particular uh, cell, then information about that cell is given to you. Okay. In the fuel setup, again, when you scroll over a particular area of the map, it tells you what that function does very similar to Howwin in the options that you have here. Now in the advanced options you can actually select the number of controls that the ECU is trying is going to uh, to do things like correction maps, fuel correction, ignition correction and any other functions that the ECU may be doing. These maps, these options will, will not show up in the ECU navigator or the tree window until they're actually selected. So you won't have to navigate your way through a whole bunch of maps that you're not using if you haven't got them selected. So in this case I might want to put the post start map, the air temperature correction map and the zero throttle map uh, in my fuel correction table. Again when I run over the top of these I do get information on what each map does in the right hand column. I hit apply and you notice over here in the fuel menu I now have those maps that I just selected. Take those correction maps off, hit apply and they're removed. Now you notice I did get a message down here saying that the ECU will need to be rebooted before this takes effect. That's okay, I'll come back to that and reboot the ECU later. Very similar to Howwin, we have optional inputs and outputs. Uh, DPO simply stands for Digital Pulsed Output. Uh, anywhere there where you select an output that requires some more information, another tab will pop up. So in this case we have um, Air Conditioning Control and you'll see up here we have a tab for AC in there. It is for the settings for that particular option. Now, if you were to put a value in here that wasn't legal, so for example we put minus 20%, that's not possible, you see what happens is the cell actually highlights in red, the tab highlights in red, and the tab on the main setup also highlights in red. I can go into any other tab and it will remain red. Anytime there is a problem in the setup, the ECU will show you that through these red exclamation marks. If you want to know what the problem is, simply click in there and it says error. This is not a legal value. So I change that back to something legal. The problem goes away, press enter, and it's good to go. I'll just go back into that page there, and uh, you can see that the error has been cleared, it's no longer highlighted in red. So all of our options that have additional information required will come up in a new tab. In addition to coming up in this tab, this information, if it has a map attached to it, so for example idle control, where you're also um, mapping some information against it, then this information will also show up in the tree. So let me just apply that there. I go to idle control. I have cold operation and warm operation. Okay. You notice that I have the main settings for idle control that also show up in the tree here. Okay, That's a very brief overview of the new ECU manager software for Platinum Sport.
1000 and Platinum Sport 2000. There's uh, plenty more options than this and uh, we will continue to do training info videos for this product. At the moment I just wanted to introduce the product to show people the power of what it can do. If you are interested in finding out more you can go down to our website which is www.howtech.com go to the downloads page engine management and go to platinum and you can actually download this software from the website for free install it on your computer so that you can discover all the great new features that come with the new Haltech Platinum Sport series of ECUs.